everyone and welcome back to my channel and to a new little thing we're going to be doing which is basically me going onto my friend's gallery page and finding her bills and making them a little bit better. My friend isn't, she knows she's not the best builder, she's never really done it before, she much prefers Cass. Look, I think this is supposed to be me. But her builds, I mean, let me have a look. I think we're gonna do this one today. She very much likes the color gray, doesn't she? Uh, she knows I'm doing this by the way. I'm not bullying her, although I do like to gently bully her at times. I just, I really want to fix the roof on this one. So I think we have all of the same packs apart from she doesn't have the crystal pack. One thing about her is she's not good at changing the names of her builds. So I know exactly where this one's going right here and I will have it she did remember to change it to a tiny home well done so we're gonna pop right in here she's really utilized this a lot as you can see and you don't know her like I know her okay we can do something with this. I told her that she's afraid of colour, so God bless her. She has added some colour just for us. She wanted this to be a tiny house. And I think I think she's she's done okay, but what I am gonna do to start with is absolutely turn this whole house around. Because if you're gonna have a house that skinny, it needs to be filling up a bit more of the lot than that my love so uh, put it in the middle as I was saying you don't know Brogan but she is not an artiste and she knows that about herself when we were in college together we were in anatomy class and she she did draw a hmm, she did do a skull we were drawing skulls for anatomy and honestly that thing is my sleep paralysis demon it haunts me every night in my sleep and she knows it does she's used singular but singular bushes bless her bless her little heart where did the front door go which front door did she even have the one from cats and dogs okay bless her little cotton socks so yeah, I think I'm just gonna get straight into this. I'll probably make it into a speed build, but I just wanted to explain what we were doing. I'm not destroying her house. What I'm doing is making it a house that I could comfortably play in and maybe teaching, her. It's, it's a teaching process, I think, teaching her that building isn't as scary and difficult as she thinks it is. So yeah let's see how this goes
okay so I'm done I don't think I changed much at all to be honest I struggled on the inside you might have noticed I she had the Murphy bed and the sofas and I just didn't know did we need both but I've made a little private bedroom like living room place and this is like so you can read your books I changed the color of the counters I did like that she'd mismatched her counters but I changed the color because it was looking a bit too white Oh, she does look white. I added some pictures, um, an extra chair because, I mean, we could technically have three people living here now. Two in there, one on the sofa. She loves these bay windows. I've noticed that from past builds that I've um, helped her with. I think that's probably because we live in the UK and they are like a staple on every house but I find them really difficult to use in The Sims, especially the cottage living one. So I changed it to the base game and one thing I did mention to her when I helped her previously was that stick to a window like and like stick to that window. So yeah, I've done this. Oh, I changed the front door as well because I think we needed a bit more room. If you're having a tiny house, it's probably not best to have a three tile wide door, you know? Um, but back to the windows, one bay window at the front and then the same window everywhere else. That's what I taught her. I've never done this before, but I quite liked it next to the woodworking station. All your different woods to, to collect. I don't know if that's what it's supposed to be or if it's just decor. She doesn't have crystal creations, but I had to put this in lovely right and um, froggy chairs just for me perfect and did you see there at the end i almost forgot to redo the roof and that was the one thing that i wanted to do in this house was change the roof so what we're going to call this is brogan's tiny house and yes that's all correct perfect and what can it be well, chef's kitchen, we've got a, quite a ni nice big kitchen for a tiny home. We've got the plant pots in the background, so we'll have great soil. And is there one forward working? Perfect. Absolutely perfect. So I'm going to upload this to the gallery and it should say, let me just write a little description. So save lot to library and let me just check because I don't like to take credit for things that are not mine. There we go. Original by Brogan XOXOXOX. Perfect. So yeah, I'm going to carry on doing these. Maybe I'll find some other people who would like to become better builders, but aren't sure what to do. And maybe I can help them too. But for now, that is the end of the video. If you enjoyed it, please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next one. Bye!